So I'm gonna show you what happens when you quarantine, you have a meltdown because you're trying to incorporate Marie Kondo's um, tips into your life. Stay tuned. So last night I attended the DJ Nice DJ Nice homeschool quarantine party, you know, where you had a hundred thousand people in in the party. I was one of them. And it was great. But while I was like, you know, dancing and stuff, I started to clean and I started to feel guilty about, you know, my clutter. <laughs> And then like Marie Kondo popped into my mind and like she's been in everybody's lives for like many, many years and everything, but <sighs> I looked at my my jars and I was like, oh my God, I have way too many jars with nothing in them and they've been sitting on some of my shelves for a long time. I was gonna can, I was, but I did it. And then it was like, does it spark joy? And it doesn't. But it does because I got it from Marshalls for $3.99. And I repurposed it because it was bread and butter pickles, which were not that great. But it doesn't matter. This is a good jar. And then this is a good jar too because it's a ball mason jar. And, um... <laughs> Um, but the, 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 the graduated numbers and stuff are wrong. So I don't feel so bad about giving this one away or recycling this one. But I'm just like, oh, I have to let go. And in order for me to grow, I have to let go of things that are, that aren't serving me. So while you're in quarantine, you know, do some cleaning. I don't know where you're going to put your trash or your recyclables or the stuff you want to donate because everything's closed. But just know that it still sparks joy, but I'm going to let it go. Oh. And if you want to know what's wrong with my scarf, I am deep conditioning and the deep conditioner is winning. It's not because my hair is exposed, but I'll... It, I just had a jar meltdown. Okay. Have a good day. I'll see you again with less jars. Mm.